Speaking of 2020, I've got something for you right here. Well, 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 well. What's up everybody? I'm coming at you from my workplace today. This isn't the typical environment a police officer would be working in. Why would a police officer in 2020 be working in this environment? Hmm. You're too fat. Buzz fam landed himself on quarantine. We'll get into how that happened. We'll tell that story, but let me give you guys a tour. Let me show you what my uh, confines, my prison cell, because that's kind of how I'm viewing it, is going to be for at least the next seven days. And today, by the way, is day number one. It's the first day. Oh, I'm going to try to get up here in the corner so you can see it all. I got a nice bed. I got a nice bed. I mean, look at this nice decorative pattern. It's beautiful. This is like what you would see on uh, playing cards. What? I mean, look at this blanket. We'll talk about that in just a minute. That is amazing. This is probably the biggest asset right here. I've got my workstation, uh, light for streaming, making videos and stuff. I can still do my work, access to the computer, work computer, police radio over there. Probably kind of hard to tell, police radio. I've been eating out since this thing started. This is day one. I'm still on day one, so I've only eaten like one meal. But I planned on going out to buy my food. I didn't want to bother going into the house, contaminating my parents' kitchen or anything like that, so I was going to buy food. My mom, being my mom, texted me saying, do you want some chicken pot pie? I was like, no, 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 don't worry about it. I don't want to do dishes. I don't want to contaminate them. I don't want to mess with that. I'll just go get some food. So, of course, she finds a way to do it anyway. This thing is sitting outside the door, this whole box. Look at this. There's a chicken pot pie, <laughs> a drink in a bag, and a truffle is that what that is yep a truffle dessert <laughs> no dishes just garbage i'm assuming i can throw this whole box away once i'm done thanks mom love you appreciate it thanks for dinner you gonna do this for breakfast or lunch every day too meanwhile hi peeps welcome back to fuzz fam today our crew consists of mommy we got the kitties back here chloe michael johnny jonah and ethan today we're going to the harvest festival what happened three days straight i lost this two two days ago this one yesterday and this one today Well done. So, I'm in the corn maze. And I met this really nice guy. Vlogging guy. Wait, 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 wait. Excuse me? She met who? I can't find my family. And now I'm in a maze all by myself. I hope I can find my way out of here before it falls dark. Wish me luck. I don't know. Maybe you should stay in there with nice vlogging guy. You guys can live happily ever after. Staying hydrated because I don't want to die. There's the sun behind me. It's sweltering, even though it's not 60 degrees. I'm wearing a sweater. The sun is hot. Oh, there's people. I'm just gonna follow somebody else. Meanwhile. What you doing? I'm making a Mandalorian gun. I printed this out, and then I'm just, like I'm taking these foam blocks, I'm laying them out, and then I'm putting it on top of it, and then I'm tracing it with a pencil and cutting it with a knife. It's working, it's worked going pretty good so far. Ethan, you didn't make this part. I will. Corn friends. Hello. I got my COVID test this morning. Actually, I'm supposed to be there like six minutes ago, and they said the tests go fast because it's one of those rapid, rapid response ones. They don't have a lot of them. So we've got to hurry and get over there and get the test taken. There's my car. I actually need to scrape snow and ice off of it now. I guess winter comes every year, no matter what, right? Mm hmm. That's right, baby. Is that better? You can see now. Of course, anybody that's ever had an Audi or driven an Audi, you guys know. They're right at home, in the snow. Right at home. 
My dad had an old one that I uh, drove in high school. For some reason, he let me drive it. Had red leather seats. I may or may not have destroyed that car. Sorry, Dad. Oh, what do you know? It's the police car. You guys are always so worried that something's wrong with it. Does it look like anything's wrong with it? The answer's no. She's fine. Well, hello, Tesla. Always a pleasure to see one of those beautiful, beautiful cars. Um, so question for you guys. This lane's blocked off, no left turn, but it's not blocked off from the other side. Can I turn? Do it. Oh, look at that. There's no plausible explanation or reason as to why there was a no left turn sign there. Now, some young rookie cop saw that. They'd probably pull me over because there was a sign that said no left turn, but come on. Common sense. Common sense. Give me a break. I'm supposed to call this number to start the process. I'm installed number one, but every time I do, it's busy. It's like the fifth time I've tried. Eventually. So I'm gonna put this Q-tip part up in your nose and I'm gonna swish it around. Oh, it's that fun each, one. <laughs> Everyone each, does. Each nostril. It's not that bad, I promise. Oh, okay, it's not, is it the brain tickler one? No, is that, no. Oh, it's, it's not that one. Okay, good no. deal. Do you need my head back? Sure. Okay. Oh, they said that one was not the brain tickler, but it feels like it tickled my brain a little bit. All right, you guys ready for the test results? Do I have the Rona or do I not? If you guys watch our live streams, you already know the answer, but can I get a drum roll, please? And my test results. Oh, that's great. Tell me something I don't know, thanks. My official actual COVID results were negative. Ladies and gentlemen, I did not have the virus and I was able to safely return to work soon thereafter and lived happily ever after what on to bigger better things let's wrap up this video with an update on the house the new fuzz fortress you guys that have been on the channel for a while or watched the last few videos you know that the reason i'm living in my parents basement is not because of a lack of success or an addiction to world of warcraft it is because we are building a new house and here we are on the new fuzz fam street oh boys and girls would you look at that? We've got cement! Yes! Yes! Look at the size of that foundation! Oh my gosh! Look at this! These are mine! These will be my white and green tube. Let's see if we can get a close-up on the quality of the cement. Oh, that's pretty quality. You get these standard cracks in here. You got these metal, metal wings. Like it's looking, oh my gosh. That looks like the inside of a barn. That's all garage, two car garage, boat RV garage. <laughs> Actually, that's where I'm gonna plan on having the home gym. I like this feature a lot. Check this out, at the very back of the garage, you come all the way back and we got steps that go down into the basement. This is actually gonna go right into the theater room. Check this out. Door going out and then at the back of the garage, steps to go down into the basement. Home theater, uh, I don't remember. Game room, bedrooms, I can't remember the layout, honestly. But this is a good indication of how tall the ceilings are gonna be. We paid extra to have tall ceilings. That's, that's gonna be how tall the ceilings are? I think it's nine foot ceilings. I think is what it is. Okay, I'm gonna set this down, go stand next to this wall. You guys can get an idea of, of hopefully this is, Mathematic scientific experiment. All right, check it. <sighs> That's going to be nice. Those are going to be tall ceilings. I'm glad we're doing extra on that. And cold storage. Cold storage. This is going to be underneath the front porch. And I'm standing right now where I think the utility room is going to be. Uh, standard blue, blue tube with nothing in it. And then, of course, we got stuff coming up out of the ground, pipes. Maybe that's going to be a bathroom or a shower or a toilet. There's another one over there. There's more over there. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not a construction expert. Oh, I'm going to rip my pants. Do it. Oh. <laughs> Uh, okay. okay. That's it. That's the tour. I, I want to look at the garage one more time. All right, this is the back corner of the garage. That's it's an old nail packet. What is that doing in my house? Oh, I am digging this. I can just feel myself lifting weights in this general area right now. This is going to be an area of 
transformation. I'm telling you guys, a new fuzz is gonna be born right here in this area. I'm telling you guys, I'm excited. I'm excited. This is the first. This is the real first Fuzz Fam update on the house. And if I can find a way to actually make YouTube videos more than twice a year, I promise we'll do some new updates and show you guys the progress as we go. Really weird time in our lives right now. I know there's a bunch of you guys out there that really like watching our stuff. We can't thank you enough for supporting us and being here, watching the videos and being a part of the Fuzz Fam. It's just one of those years, bear with us. Like it's just hard to record videos. We're separated from each other. I'm never around to like edit and, and record anyway. So it's just, it's gonna be one of those years. There's just not gonna be a lot of content, but we are still live streaming. If you like to come watch us live stream on Twitch, we do that once or twice a week, but we will keep you guys updated as much as possible. We'll put out videos whenever we can and hopefully get back to a more normal life and recording schedule and YouTube and everything once we move into the house. At the time I'm recording this and putting this video out, it is just about Christmas 2020. Speaking of 2020, I've got something for you right here. That's right. That's right. If anybody's wondering, that's Allison, our uh, our third oldest kid. <laughs> that's my favorite picture of her. I keep wanting to get it framed and put it up in our house, but Mrs. Fuzz just doesn't want to for some reason. So 2020 can get bent. We are looking forward to 2021. I'm sure everybody is. We love you guys. Thanks for being here. Have a good Christmas. Have a good new year. We will see you on the next video. Peace.